and welcome to the show. We are here today on BeamNG Drive, playing around with another mod uh, that I saw. This is a parkour circuit for cars. Uh, I like these kind of driving challenges, if you will. Um, you know, you want to try and do things a little bit differently. How well I'm going to do with this, I don't know. Um, for this one, there are varying uh, difficulties You're using the standard truck. Now, it says on platforms you can save the spawn point. I think I'm going to try and do this legit. I think I have a very quick run through these first couple of sections uh, just to see how it all works. I think basically, so we we'll just get started. This bit here should be too hard. I think we can basically reset the truck and save on a platform like this. Uh, that To me, that's what the sign says. So I can just press left on the D-pad. It will reset my spawn point so I can tackle uh, these obstacles. Uh, we'll see how far we can, can get through. Uh, God knows how some of this is going to work, but... Uh, <laughs> I'm going to give it a try. I don't think I'm going to get all the way through. I'm going to give it a try. Uh, we will reset here. I don't know if any of these are going to require momentum. I would presume not. Uh, if you've got these save points. Uh, can we... Oh, that's quite a long way. Ugh. I mean... We did... Uh, does that count? I'm going to say... I'm going to try and do it so I can stay on my wheels. If I get really stuck, then I'll take that as a node grabber it over. Uh, so it doesn't have to go very far up, but it doesn't go quite a long way up on that one. Ow, that's definitely not how you do it. Sorry, truck. Oh, the wheels pinged off. Everything broke, actually. <laughs> that's not how to do it. Got to go a little bit. <gasps> Could we go around the tunnel? <gasps> okay, I'm trying it. I feel like this is unnecessarily complex. Whoa, it may be possible. I feel like that, yeah, I don't think that's the way to do it. It would be cool. Oh, the wheel's gone. <laughs> oh, it's over there. Uh, that's that's a little over the top in terms of uh, necessity. We were much closer the first time I bent that front wheel on my way up to here. I've got no steering! <laughs> this is the difficulty with doing this on beam is sometimes like little innocuous bumps can actually cause you a load of problem. Uh, where other games it just wouldn't really matter. Uh, right, so we just... There we go. That's how it's done. Uh, is there a platform? Oh, no, that's a jump. I'm going to save my vehicle here because we did that one absolutely spot on. Hopefully this isn't a big jump and I needed the momentum from coming out the tube. Uh, no, we're all good. Uh, I'm not going to bother saving here. We should, we, we can do that uh, jump again if we need to. Ugh. Okay, maybe not too fast because the back of the truck likes to bounce around and if the back pings up in the air, it pushes the front down and that will push it into the floor and cause me grief. So we don't want that. Uh, there is a gap. It would be very easy to fall in that gap if I wasn't paying attention. Cool. Right, we're on the platform. We go across some speed bumps. That's no issue. I'm not going to bother saving here. Uh, oh, okay. That's a big drop. I guess we've got to go over here with a little bit of speed. Uh, no, too much speed. <laughs> if we don't go over there with enough speed, I think we're just going to... We're going to beach ourselves. So we've got to go over there with with a good amount of... With enough pace to not beach ourselves, but with as little as possible. Because uh, if we go over too fast, we're going to do a front flip, or we're just going to lose control. And we've got to have momentum to get up the other side. We do. Hey! Okay, all is good. All is good so far. Uh, this is just another little, like, checkerboard bit. Uh, now, I'm, I, I'm sure if you're good enough, you can do the whole lot without having to reset your truck. I'm going for the let's not be infuriating uh, <laughs> thing. And uh, focus on actually, you know, just getting through each obstacle oh, at a time. This first this stuff is the easier stuff on the map, so it's going to get more difficult. Uh, I guess we've got to try and not snap a wheel off. So we want to go as central as possible. That's not too bad, actually, through there. I'm sure we're going to have that where we actually saw that blue, like, scissor bit. Uh, that looks mean. I don't know if I've got to carry momentum through here. Uh, oh, okay, I've lost sight of my truck. I'm just going to go floor it and hope. If in doubt, actually, that's a really bad approach to take to what is probably kind of more precision driving stuff. But hey, we are out. All right, all of that has been completed. All right, so ooh, we've got more topsy-turvy stuff here. Looks like it's a little bit more extreme. Do I want speed or do I want caution? Uh, oh, God. I want better driving than that. Can I save myself here? Yes, okay, we can. Uh, yeah, we definitely want better driving than that. I mean, we're still on the platform. Up oh, and there we go. Nice. I will take that. Okay, caution kind of worked there. <laughs> Aside from the little jacket. Oh, now we've got to do the topsy-turvy uphill. This will probably require a bit of speed. I don't want to go too much because if we get it wrong and you hit the edge with this, we're just going to snap the wheel off and then we're going to be in real trouble. 
Uh, that's fine. Actually, that wasn't as bad. It looked worse than it was. Ooh, do we have... I mean, okay, again, it says it's for the default truck. I'm just looking at this, and do I have the ground clearance to do this? How do I get up here? Do I go really slowly? No, slow's not the answer there. I guess we're going to have to give it a little bit of welly and kind of bounce our way up. If I can get it. Oh, ow. <laughs> Uh, truck. There we go. Okay, that was a little bit nasty. I was hoping if I kind of accelerate as hard as I can, I know it's not going to wheelie, but if we get the weight transfer back, it gives us as good a chance as possible to get the front up, uh, which it kind of did. Maybe we needed more speed. Uh, I feel like some of these, some of these, we may have to just go for a bit of speed and accept the fact we're going to do some damage to the vehicle. Uh, we're still climbing. Oh, no. Oh, we got away with that one. I thought we were in trouble. We might still be. Uh, straighten it up. Come on, bounce the rear wheel up. Try and carry momentum where I can. I might have to just go for it here and hope with enough momentum we can uh, climb up this stuff. There we go. There's the there's the finish. We've bent the frame out. Actually, we've we've done a lot of damage to the truck. I would just like to point that out. I will reset it before we carry on. But I've done a lot of driven tool destruction, and I've used this truck before. And I don't think I've ever broken the rear suspension that well. <laughs> it's actually the whole thing has like, you know, what, screw it. We're gonna try. Oh no. Uh, Screw it, I reckon we can get up this hill with the broken suspension. Let's do it. Here we go, truck. Ugh. It's actually still driving pretty well. Um, yeah. <laughs> See, if I do, if I press F7, will this work? Uh, nope. <laughs> Just step back there. Never mind. I thought it was F7 to reset your spawn point. Um, with While keeping the same damage. Maybe I need to have a camera over here. I suppose that's the normal one I use for it. There we go. I guess it's just so I can reset myself here, but continue on with the same level of damage uh, that I've got, because I'm curious as to how far I can make it with a busted rear suspension. Uh, but I don't know what the obstacle is going to get like. This is just climbing up a hill. Whether that collapsed suspension is going to really hinder us here, I don't know. I didn't have a very good run-up to this. Okay, come on. We can do this. We can just roll the truck back. And we're going to start again, but we're going to try and carry speed. Now, it might not be doable because it's got no ground clearance anymore with that busted suspension, and indeed it's broken. <laughs> it's beached. Ah, oh, come on, truck. Yeah, we'll node grabber you off here. Uh, there we go. I feel like that's fair. Oh, uh, right. Oh, what do we? I'm hoping that's the spare wheel. <laughs> it's not what. Well, it is one of mine, but it's not an important one. Okay. I think caution to the wind! Go truck! Go! Oh, maybe not. No, no, okay. Little more caution. Little more caution uh, is is the way to go. We want enough speed. We, we want just below the speed at which the truck gets big airtime, I think, is the, the trick. Like that. There we go. Now we're probably going to have to be flat out the whole way. That's fine. Come on, D Series. You can do it. Climb, 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 climb. Hey! We are good to go. Right, into the tunnel we head. Oh, that's a very steep drop. Uh, actually, maybe don't carry crazy amounts of speed, because I don't know what, how twisty the tunnel is going to be. So we will... Ch oh, on the brakes for this change of direction. Try and remember whatever GTA knowledge I had from the old uh, stunt circuits. Uh, try to get like, the change of direction in the tunnels right. Okay, we've got a big hill to climb. I feel like these red ones haven't actually been too bad. The first obstacles were worse. These ones haven't been awful. My steering's now a bit bent as well. Oh, come on, truck. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Well, hey, we're up. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to continue to not really reset the spawn point. Uh, if if I fall off, I'll just free camera my way back to the platform because it's actually kind of fun to see what we can do with this level of damage. Speed, speed. But I've got to stop before I go off the end. Okay, we've now broken the front suspension as well. <laughs> but we made it to the platform. Oh, God. I don't need broken suspension for this. This bit looks like we've got twiddly bits and my steering pulls. Oh, God. Can I not get up that? Uh, I'm going to have to hit it with an angle, I think. Come on, truck. Oh, no. I don't actually know if we can climb up there. <laughs> going to give it another try. Yeah, okay. That might be too, it might be too slammed. Now, yeah, we've got no ground clearance. <laughs> Oh dear, well we really broke the suspension, in fact, oh, he's really busted. That's quite impressive level of broken. Okay, uh, we will reset the truck and we will continue our journey onwards. Yeah, no no problem normally. Uh, yeah, actually, this isn't as bad. The first part was way worse for the old uh, climbing up awkward points. 
There we go. We are through. Right, this tunnel. It's like it's just down, up, and there's a left hand. Oh, and then we're out of the red stuff. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. Need a little more speed than that. Can we... <laughs> that might be the dumbest failure yet. Not gonna lie. Uh, we will just pull our truck back. I'll just use that to, to reset us up here, because I can't remember where I reset the truck. So, a little bit more speed over here. Oh, I don't want to go too fast, because, yeah, I don't want a big jump. You think you could get away with a bit more pace, actually, down there. Again, enough to get it up the hill, but not so much we hit the ceiling. Would be good. Uh, on the wall, around there. Is nicely done. But hey, we are into the blue segment, and now we're into another tunnel. Where does this tunnel go? Uh, up, by the looks of it. I guess we're just going to boot it and hope. If in doubt, oh, is it very trippy? I don't know what YouTube compression is. I mean, they're not going to be the weird glitchy tubes with all the holes in that uh, you get on GTA. At least maybe the lines might mess with the compression. It should be okay. Uh, I'm just kind of going to try and maintain speed and hope we don't have a sudden change of direction so we smack it into a wall. That's the goal here, to avoid face planting a wall. However, uh, we're going to keep carrying speed. Oh, okay, that's not in there. Not as technical a tube as I thought it was going to be. We have got a much smaller tube coming up. Sure. Can't really see where this one is heading. I guess we're just going to go for it. Oh, bloody hell. Okay. Sure, we've got a near vertical drop into a very twiddly section. Okay, actually not quite as steep there as I thought it was. Oh, and now we're into the turns. I guess we keep it up on the wall. Oh, yeah, that's the danger of keeping it up on the wall is when it changes back direction. You just get no warning that it's coming because you're constantly cornering. Uh, I guess you could kind of cheese it a little bit, but with the camera outside, it's very difficult to tell where the car is positioned. Whoop. Here we go. It's fine. I mean, the actual steering's done quite well. It's, it's busted up the front end, but nothing awful. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on. Get spat out. Hey! <laughs> okay, now it has busted up the front end quite nicely. <laughs> oh, that steering's completely knackered. Oh, we survived it, though. We got spat out the other side. The truck is good. Oh, okay. This is a bit nasty. or a hill to climb. Uh, say that, we've only got to deal with like one sort of scissor platform and then we're over the other side. Oh, oh, hey, there we go. Okay, so serrated run. This is what we saw from the start line. Uh, we can do this. I think we're going to have to just boot it and hope. I don't think slow is going to be the answer here because I think we're just going to beach it. I mean, it doesn't really like the boot it and hope option. Can boot it and hope may not... Oh, because that's if we go slowly, it's just always going to beach out in the middle. Um, don't know what we want to do here. We're just kind of going for it. Come on, truck. Come on, truck. Keep momentum going. Don't get beached. Don't get beached. Ah, oh, it's got beached. Can I rescue it from here? If you go too fast, you bounce around and that loses you momentum. You go too slow, you're going to... Too slow? Too slow, you're going to beach it and get stuck. Hmm. Okay. Well, there is a, there is a pause point in all of this. Uh... Can we just, like, ride on top of these? Not really. Uh, you just have to accept that it's going to get clonked about. But that's fine. I mean, we're, we're back to the really nasty section. That bit there's not too bad. I mean, it takes some damage, but that's about it. Uh, right. I guess if we... Okay, I'm going to try not too slowly. Oh, you see, that's too slow. That is too slow. So if you go, if you go too slow, you just get stuck like that. Not what you want. Go too quick, you bounce around in the air too much, and then don't carry enough momentum. This one here, I think we're being shaken about too far up, but can we? No. Nope. But <laughs> that doesn't work either. Hmm. Do we try go? I don't think going up like on this part here is a good idea. Well, maybe if we can just keep. Momentum, it's so tantalizingly close. Oh. If we could lock up the diffs, it might do it. I'm sorry for the horrific tire screech. Uh, come on. If you had better diffs, we could do it that way, but we can't. That was closer. I mean, that was weirdly a better way of doing it. Do we just kind of go, right, launch it up on the top part here? And then if it bounces, launch it across the other side and just keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. No, no, you're right at the end, truck. Don't you bloody... What are you doing? Please. Please don't. Please. No, no, not now. We got so close. That's park. I don't want park. Oh, you bugger. Can I, not, I can't wheel you free anywhere. Any way, can I? Nope. <laughs> D 
Damn, so close. Okay, that's kind of working, though. Weirdly, I did not think this would be a strategy that would work here, but it's just like, keep it going, keep it bouncing. No, that's not worked that time. Hmm. You know what, screw it, let's just fire it up this way. Oh, definitely not worked that way. Hmm. Okay. Cautious, through the middle. Oh, we stopped, it, it stopped bouncing a bit. I wonder if we could do it this way. Oh, come on. You <laughs> I had a wonderful idea, but the truck's a little bit too wide. Yeah, no, that's not going to work, is it? God's sake. I wonder if we're going like, to revert, like, like reverse and forward it um, between these platforms, but not quite. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's so close to doing that. I just got beached again. I feel like there's a smart way of doing it, and I'm not thinking of it. And I've not got to it yet. What's the smarter way of doing this? I feel like if I go slowly, we just get stuck. Brute force does not seem to be working. Because it just gets stuck in a different way. Oh, you're so annoying, truck. You're diff. Makes me so angry. It's got all of the wheels on the bloody ground and it's still not working. Wait, hold on. Can I cheese this? No, he's going to get stuck. Oh, what, is it? what are you even stuck on? Bloody, go fall down here, you annoying truck. <laughs> you know, I feel a little bit better after that one. Here we go, come on. We've got this. Kind of, right. Okay, I had a little lift on the way in there. If I lift, it just gets worse. It started off better. I think these get slightly further apart as we get further along. Maybe. Maybe just because we lose momentum, it gets it feels slightly worse. Right, I'm going to aim a little bit to the left. Still not working. How do I get past this? I've had way more luck firing it down one of the sides. Oh, oh it's done it. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. We made it. Reset immediately. Yeah, I, I was saying. I'm having more luck firing it off center than I was down the center. You kind of fire it off center, bounce it across, and then you go to the other. We were firing it left, and then you bounce right to kind of get it to the finish line. It worked. I don't, I feel like there's a much smarter way of doing it, but that's a way that worked for me, so I shall take it. What are we doing here? Uh, we're going downhill. Okay. We got okay. We go downhill. Very narrow. We've got to be very precise with the truck. Uh, it's not so steep as to ground the truck out, so I don't have to worry about speed. Might have to do a little bit here. Oh. No, no, we're good. We're good. Carefully does it. Down there. This is a horrible turn. Oh, I'm going to beat you, aren't I? Well, this is annoying. <laughs> okay, I need to take a little bit more speed. I wonder if... Uh, I mean, because we, we, we're playing it a bit carefully. I wonder if I just go for, you know what, screw it. Let's carry momentum over here. Ooh! I got oversteer. I got, well... <sighs> That's not gonna work, is it? Okay, that's a, that was a little bit too much speed. There is a fine line. So yeah, you can't... Ch I was hoping we could just inch over the edge, but if you do that, you just beat yourself. So we've gotta be... I mean, I, I wonder whether we can kind of cheese this one. <clears throat> okay. Shouldn't try and cheat. Cheats never prosper. And all that. The truck still works, but geez, <laughs> I was trying to see if I could just jump to the finish line and magically land on the wheels. It'd break the truck, but if we landed, as long as it landed on its wheels, I'd say it was completed. Just not necessarily in the intended way. Uh, oh, there we go. Good. No, reverse. Oh, come on, truck. There we go. Whew. I will take it. What the hell this looks easy enough to oh why does that happen okay what do we do I get uh, where did we go off I guess do we you know um <laughs> physics didn't know what to do there is there some sort of trick to this is it like 
Can we drive down the edges? Nope. I don't know how I can tell until I've fallen in. I guess, okay, I'm guessing there's like an invisible path uh, that we can't see, and the only way we can find it is by trying. So let's go... Okay, so this bit's solid. So we are... Column, what, how many... You know what I'm about. I know what column we're going to. Aim for this one. So I guess we should inch forward. Okay. Uh, is this next forward bit solid? Yes. Is this bit solid? Yeah. Don't, is it going to be just a straight forward? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> the second, I think. All right. Maybe it's just a straight forward line. I'm, okay, I'm going to guess this is a kind of a maze sort of thing. So we get one, two, three. Is it this one is the final one. That is solid. Okay, so we know forward is falling through. Do I need to turn left? I'm just going to dip the wheel in and see what happens. But that looks like that's solid to me. So I guess we can go left. One. Is uh, I'm hoping I don't have to turn because it's going to be really awkward. That looks good to me. Now do we keep going straight? Uh, okay, inch it forward. Nope. Not straight. I'm gonna hope we're gonna. I'm gonna aim towards the goal because I expect that's the way the maze is gonna go. Okay, we're good here. Uh, please let this one here also be solid. It is. I'm gonna guess this one here probably won't be, but I'll check just in case. Uh, doesn't look like it. Nope. Uh, if I was a map designer, well, we've already made one left turn, so I'm gonna try going right. Nope. Okay, we're going left. <laughs> As long as I don't dip the wheel in fully, I think we're okay. Uh, now, is that one over there solid in front? Nope. That one there isn't solid in front of it, so we're going over here. Uh, I'm hoping this platform bit there is. Let's just check if this corner... Nope, that bit there is uh, going to fall in. We do have to go all the way to the edge. So this bit here's got to be solid. I guess unless we go back on ourselves, it is. Are you solid? Yep. Uh... Please be solid bit there. It looks like it is. Okay. That was a fun little uh, <laughs> a fun little puzzle. Uh, normally you do that it, not in driving games. Ooh, narrow little path. Okay. So we will reset our car here. Uh, how the hell am I going to make... Oh, that was appalling. That was, that was a terrible piece of driving by me. I apologise. I can do a lot better. So this is very narrow. It is just wide enough for the truck, but wheel, the wheel's going to hang off in places. The wheel's going to hang off in places, and the diff's terrible. Hmm. I don't really want to have to try and do this with speed, though. Oh, God, I've not got that depth right there. Yeah, it's just like I'm going to have to carry, try and carry momentum so that if a wheel does drop off the edge, we get away with it. But that's not that's easier said than done because the second the wheel drops off the edge, the truck has a nope sort of a thing going on. How the hell do I get around here? Other than very carefully, and a lot of reversing is involved. Uh Okay. I've not got to the stage of cheating yet, but does it feel like if I got up here and booted it, we could bounce and bounce and scrabble our way onto the green platform? Is that cheating? Probably. It might come to that. We'll have to wait and see. I don't know how else I'm going to get... I don't know how I'm going to get around that corner because it's so difficult. It's such a tight turn. I don't know how the steering lock of this truck is ever going to be able to do that. Uh, it really doesn't feel like it's got the steering lock to do it. It feels like I've got to try and carry momentum. You know what, let's just try the cheating route. Oh, there's definitely a way to cheat. Well, let's say there's a way to cheat. I feel like if I can bounce that, that's legit. Fair enough. Um, the platforms are kind of lined up so you can do it. Uh, some will claim it is cheating. I will claim it is creative use of game mechanics. Uh, <laughs> fancy, the fancy word for cheating. That's too much speed now. Um... Yeah, I, I, I feel like i got more luck, more chance of doing this if I get that turn there right than I do actually making the silly hairpin. And this is slightly less infuriating as well. You're just carrying speed, bounce, 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 done! <laughs> yeah. I don't know whether that is the, the way you're supposed to do it. There may be a, You may be able to take that corner legit, but I feel like that is definitely a million times easier. Uh, so I will take the cheating. Where the hell are we going here? Do I need a lot of speed? Yep, quite a lot of speed. Oh, God. Okay, we're going to have to fight this. 
Come on, truck. You can make it. Not quite. If the diff was any good, we might be able to, but the diff is terrible. And I think it is mostly beached. Okay, so this we've got to carry quite a lot of speed up. I guess we don't lift is the way to do it. Just don't lift the whole way up. Let it bounce. Carry speed, carry speed, carry speed. Go, 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 go. Maybe put low range, actually. Low range may be a way to do this. I've not really been thinking about because of the hill. Uh, let's give it a try. Uh, what the low range can do. Because we don't really need much in the way of speed. I have been... Yeah, okay. Low range is definitely the way to go. Right. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that's fine. I ha to be fair, we haven't really had a problem with the climbs before. Maybe low range would have been the way to go for some of the other obstacles. I don't think... I feel like this is the one... This is the first real need for it. Uh, can I recover this? Oh, my steering is a little bit poorly. That front wheel. However... Power up through. We are good. Hey! That's a very narrow platform. That will need working steering for. If you, By the way, if you aren't supposed to reset on these platforms, and you're only supposed to reset in between zones, um, I mean, I would applaud your patience in getting this far, because I can tell you now, I wouldn't. Oh, that was not well done by me. Oh, well, my front wheel's fallen into it anyway, so I feel like that's a fair... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> don't think it matter what I do with the back of the car, the front was going to get stuck anyway. Uh, at least if you can do this in first person also, uh, fair play to you. That would be impressive because I'm going to use all of the tricks that I have on offer. How am I supposed to do that? I guess other than just speed it? Okay. I'm not sure what's going on with that. I feel like that shouldn't be happening unless it is supposed to happen like that and you're supposed to go across here at speed so you don't get stuck like that. So let's go across here at speed, though. That's a mean obstacle. Uh, well, I guess the course is designed to be mean. Okay, that looks like we're mostly straight. You know what? I I'm going to go for it. We're going to see what happens. Go on, truck. Oh, it just went off course. It hit and went slightly off course. Hmm. Okay. It's, it's, as it went down like this bump, it just went off course. It feels like it's just, yeah, it's just falling straight through the floor there. That feels a bit off to me. Personally, as far as obstacles go, I don't mind a challenge, but that feels a little bit... It's not like there's any other way we can get around here. It is just does have to be blinding speed. Which, on, on this section here, guys, I feel like that's lined up. I'm going to... Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I was going to be lazy and reset the truck so it's lined up with here. It's not lined up there. Uh, there we go. A little bit of a shuffle. A little bit of a shuffle. Okay, the wheels are on. Pretty good there. Okay. Go, truck. Go, 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 go. Oh, it's going to slide off. If we, uh, maybe... Okay, maybe if we just get it going and then lift. Okay, that does seem to work. If you go too slow, you fall... If you go too slow, you fall through it. That's really difficult to balance. <laughs> Yeah, okay, so it it's not blinding speed the way to do it, it's... Oh, we slipped off. Ah! Oh, we, we the rear wheel slipped off and we were fine, and then the front wheel fell through, the front wheel both have fallen through there. Uh, right, okay. So the truck wants to crab a little bit. No, I overcorrected that one. Okay, here we go. So it is, it is go as slow as possible without falling through. Oh no, you... Ugh. I panicked because it fell down. It went through again. You little bugger. We almost got there. I can do this. I can do this. I'm not I'm determined not to be beaten by this. Why did you get stuck in there? <laughs> it was going so well. Uh, okay, come on, truck. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. That'll do. Woo! That is a horrible. I think that obstacle is more difficult than it's supposed to be. Uh, I don't think this. I don't think it was intended to do that. It might be a side effect of like the uh, textures or props or whatever was being used to create that. I, yeah, I don't think that's the uh, legit uh, intention behind that test. If it is, that's a really arsy thing. A little bit unnecessarily arsy, if you ask me. Um, but yeah, it is doable. It's a bit of a pain. Uh, right. Ooh. Okay. I can figure this one out. We can go from side to side here. Oh, and other side. Ugh. Oh dear. Okay, well, we got low range. 
We can shuffle that about. That's no problem. We are across. Just seen the wall that I think that's coming up. Oh, fun times. Oh, no. I hate these. <laughs> okay. We've got to go really... Not like that. <laughs> really steeply, but definitely, definitely not like that. Uh, okay. I guess there's slightly less height needed for that side, and then, yeah. That'll... Okay, it's not as quite as far as I thought it was going to be. That works for me. All is good. We are through. We're on to the next part. We can save that. Uh, we got to dodge through some blocks, I guess, here. Uh, there is a gap. Yep, we're going to aim for that gap. Aim for that gap. Bounce our way downhill. And we are out of that. Ooh, okay, we got a... Uh, for some reason, I thought we were going to be climbing that wall. I guess it makes more sense that we're going down it. Sure, here we go. Oh... That's not so bad. If I can get the back end to stop bouncing, it's just once it starts sort of reverberating around, the truck's really difficult to get back under control again. Come on, D-Series. We can do this. We can do this. Oh, there we go. We're off that wall of death. Now we are going to be climbing whatever this next obstacle is. I feel like speed might be needed here to keep the truck stuck to the wall. Oh. Come on, D-Series. Fly. No, don't, don't bounce into that, though. <laughs> Made it. That's bloody terrifying. That's actually, I thought we were going to go straight into like a sticky out part and kill all our momentum, but thankfully we didn't. Uh, right, is this going to be a slow and steady sort or a bounce and speed? Looks like slow and steady probably is the way to go. It's not going to get beached, I don't think. Low range should see us up this hill, no problem. Uh, oh, dear. <laughs> I thought there was a platform at the top. I, I don't know why. I saw the tube and I thought we were going into the start of the yellow tube. And I was bloody wrong on that one. Ouch, that was the face. We're going to smack off of that and keep going. And then we will come to a halt. Hey, we completed the green section of this. Well, um... Well, well I'll, see, I'll, see where, I'll see where this goes. Uh, this is a really fun... Said a really fun little driving challenge. Aside from that uh, sort of weird green, um, very thin platform that seems irritating with it randomly falling through the floor, uh, yeah, this is this is a fun little bit of a, a driving challenge. Um, I think I've been playing by the rules as far as resetting goes. Uh, if you want to try and get through each section cleanly, I mean, best of luck to you, uh, especially if you break the steering at some point, because uh, I imagine that will not go well for this poor truck. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I, I, I love these sort of challenges. Uh, it's just a different kind of test of driving. This is a bit more of a test of precision, and sometimes patience. I don't really have that much patience. Uh, <laughs> that's that's what I learned from these, is my patience is terrible. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> I guess this is going to be a speedy, and uh, like, grind your way across that gap. Let's see what happens. Come on, D-Series. What have you got? It's the only way I can see the vehicle making it through there. Ugh. Uh, I think that cut my brake line. It did not want to stop. It's, yeah, that did not want to stop at all after that. Uh, but yeah, this is really, as I say, it's a really fun, well-made map. With the except, I say, with the exception that little uh, that green section could probably do with a look at. Um, otherwise, though, this is yeah, this is good fun. It's a good little, uh, good little driving test. Um, so I do very much uh, recommend if you want something a little bit different on Beam to have a go with. Uh, definitely give this a. Uh, I recommend. I shall, of course, put a link to it in the description if you want to have a go with it yourself and try not to get too frustrated at some of the sections. I don't know how difficult the final bits are going to get. This stuff here hasn't been too bad uh, so far. It's been a little bit of it's, you know, it's been challenging without being ridiculous, uh, which is yeah, kind of what you what you want. Definitely, low range will help once you get into some of the more fiddly sections. Uh, what is going on here? I feel like I'm going to get myself stuck if I'm not careful. But yeah, I'll stick a link to this in the description so you can download it and uh, have a go with it yourself. We've bananaed the truck, and I feel like that is a good point at which to end uh, this particular video. Thank you all very much for watching, and until next time, a goodbye.